So when did you last colour your hair? Um, about a month ago. And you like to be a bit darker than this, a bit deeper. Mm -hmm. This is a bit too, maybe a bit too golden and light for you. Yeah, I like to be quite deep and warm, right. yeah. To really be able to give you something that's deeper and really warm mm -hmm. and rich. I think chestnut brunette would really mm -hmm. help to accentuate the tones that you've already got in your hair. Yeah. But also as well, it really works well with your gorgeous blue eyes oh, and, you. and your skin tone. Open the gloss and mm -hmm. squeeze some into your hand. Because your hair is coloured, you're going to need to get it all over your hair. So right. it's going to need to be even really from the root to the end. And how much for a section? I would start pretty small. Yeah, perfect. Much? You can always add more. Okay, you can't think Work it all the way through your hair, like you would do if you were applying a, a mask or a conditioner. Okay. And then put a little bit more in, and then start from the root. Great, such a good application. The more you kind of massage it into the hair, the more mm -hmm. you'll get an even result. Okay. Great. So that's it. Your application's on, and you now need to leave that on for 20 minutes. Okay. Just rinse, don't yeah. shampoo, and then ready to blow dry. Excellent. So there we go, that is the finished results of your chestnut brunette gloss and as anticipated it's added a little bit of depth, so mm. some richness and I love deepness, it. but also that lovely warm mm. chestnutty tone that I think really makes your hair look super healthy mm. and super shiny. I'm really happy with it. It looks great. Thank you.